that means I'm officially more than halfway through the game. Let's just check out the cave, even though I'm probably gonna get my butt kicked. <clears throat> well, this looks like, oh God, what are those? I gotta make sure I'm staying aiming at this thing. Oh, I can't avoid. Oh, the Dongo's great. Can I jump? Nope. Oh god, oh god, the Dongo's, I need to bomb, but... It goes over top of them! <clears throat> Damn it. No! Damn action button. Now I'm down to four. Old games aren't poop? That's correct, they aren't poop. Thank you, Steel. Oh crap, I... No, just go, 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 go that way. So like I said, you get caught with one enemy, they can just take you out. Stop jumping and just go. Okay, I'm gonna let him go. No, Bay is poop. You must not know your. All right, just go. Oh, I got out. Oh no! <laughs> Bay is poop. I don't know what you're talking about. So you're saying old games aren't poop. So that's nice of you, Steel. I appreciate that. I was really surprised I got through that tower. It has been a while since I've played, so I knew I was going to be quite rusty. Oh god, this jumping. I really wish I had the uh, the hand, the actual controller. Still wouldn't make it that easier to play, just I don't like having my hand so close like this. You like poop? Oh good. Oh, I got both of them. Don't, no, don't throw another one. I didn't want to throw another bomb. All right, so how do I get up here? Ah, there's the rocks. You never know where the heck you can jump in these games. Go, 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 go. Okay, okay. Oh, and then they appear out of nowhere, and then I fall. Oh, good, here we go, cave. Yeah, all right. I don't know, I may keep playing this tonight then. Heroes lost. Oh, no. Uh, let's try this magic lantern. <clears throat> See if it does. Oh, I can't use... <sighs> You have to step away from the door because because it's dark I can't see where the door is so I can't crouch down to bring up my inventory because crouching down and using the action action button uh, what oh no just hitting B or hitting action on the door in general oh okay it's worse ever all of them or whatever. So let's see if this magic magic lamp stays lit the whole time, I wonder. Son of darkness. I don't know if it's the worst ever, but I didn't have too much problem with them. Oh, that counts as a hit. How do I get up there? Damn freaking flying ropes. I'm guessing those are ropes. Oh, and it stays lit. So yeah, the magic lantern only one use and it stays lit. That is awesome. But how the hell? Jump. Oh, I was trying to hit him. I guess I'm gonna have to get that little ledge. Oh no, it doesn't stay lit. Oh no, it just stays lit longer. That ledge right there and then up. Oh crap. Rumor for episode 9 title? Again, more on you and your rumors. I want to be Triumph the Insult Dog for games. I want to be Triumph the Insult Dogs. Insult Dog for games and consoles? Oh, you mean you want to be him, the, his equivalent to, okay. <clears throat> if I can just get past this first one and keep my attack. Oh my god. 
I made sure everything was clean, nothing was blocking my sensor. It's just just a bad game. I hate having to use all this lantern oil. It does stay lit a lot longer, which is nice, but... Oh, you know what? I bet you I can use a... a rope then. It's kind of stupid that they would do that. But heck, what am I, what am I talking about? Oh, crap! <laughs> It takes me back out. All right, so let's go buy some stuff in town here. <clears throat> Cross between the wee and poop. Sorry, man. This is a good place to get uh, money as well. Oh, crap. Well, I don't have my shooter. Damn, Arbogos, get out of my way. Right, give me green. Aren't red one? Even though it doesn't give you joy. So yeah, red is one. Green is five, and blue is ten. I don't even know where the heck I'm supposed to go for my the shop and all that. It's been that long. I want to say it's all the way to the right, but I could be wrong. Oh, I forgot about him. What's this? Bread man, which we have a piece of bread, but I don't remember what that does either, so. <clears throat> no, this isn't either. I find more, more joy in stuffing other dogs' butts. Others, other dogs? But so you're saying yourself, you are a dog? Oh, you're being... You're being triumph, okay. Oh wait, no, this is the shop right here with the big sign outside. It says shop in CDI graphics. Ah, crap. <clears throat> well, you can't see that it says shop, but it is. You've been watching triumph videos. You're fine, man. See, so, yeah, this is the shop here. All right, let's go. Oh no, this isn't the shop. What the hell is this then? Oh, bat! Crap, well, maybe. Is there not a shop here? Is it the very first door that's here too? What the hell? Come on. Alright, just go. Go inside. Okay, here it is. Uh, five for lantern, 20 for, oh geez, okay, well let's see what I need. No hero, he's banned. I need to buy a bunch of stuff. And the cloak, also, the cloak uses 20 rupees, which is so stupid. I just gotta go on a crazy rampage of just buying, or of just getting a ton of rupees. So let's get five rope, which is going to be 50. Oh, man. Well, let's get this first. Five, three, four. You want to watch Triumph of the Republican National Convention? <clears throat> oh, wow. It gives you. Oh, I've got 27 lane. Okay. So I guess it's five for five. I'll just buy one last one to see what it does. No, it gives you three. Okay. Okay, well, that's a ton there. So, how many rope do I get when I buy one? We have five. So, for ten, it gives you three again. Okay, so 20. That's that. Crap, yeah, I need to go get some rupees. It looks like we're going to go back to the pirate ship because that was a really good area for. Uh, how many bombs do we get? Five. So it looks like you get th qu three quantity of everything that you buy, and I'm down to 12 rupees, so. <clears throat> All right, well, let's, 
Let's go. Yeah, I don't like this town for getting. Uh, actually, I need to go back in. Go back to the main. Menu. Or the the open world. Oh yeah. All right. I mean, so now technically now it'll be up to you guys that are here. If uh, I'll, like I said, I'll play this for about an hour. If you guys want me to continue playing it, I will. Um, because Hero isn't here to watch his request. <clears throat> so yeah, so it'll be up to you guys. Let's make sure I have something selected that's not going to screw me over on all right, ropes so far. Oh, just getting to the ship, though, is the problem, but we'll see. You got to make sure you get to that spot in the screen where you drop down in order for you to be able to walk. Stupid guy. Oh, wow. oh, it turned the character because I was on the back of him. Oh, that time it didn't, it didn't turn there, though. Go! Oh, you could have jumped again. Stupid Zelda. Stupid Zelda. I'm fighting now, Falsy. I'm right there with you, man. I've been up since just about 5, a little before 5 a.m. I came home after work. Tried to sleep for a little bit. I couldn't and then just had to go pick up my my daughter so it's been a it's been a long day oh, don't jump again oh i was right there i might as well well i might as well go and well i think if i if i leave and come back do i Oh, I don't have any life counter. I think if I leave and come back, I still have the same amount of lives, so let's just try it. I would like to play the third of the CDI Zelda games, which I have not played any of. Uh, Zelda's Adventure. It's a top-down kind of in the classic style of Zelda. It still looks like crap, of course. But that would be one uh, that I would like to play in the uh, upcoming year, so. <clears throat> Alright, there we go. Now I can actually hear the game live. Live! Oh, I didn't want to jump up there. Honestly, if somebody could remake these games and make them better, that'd be that'd be fantastic. Has anybody out there done like a fan recreation of it? Because these honestly could be kind of fun side-scrolling Zelda games. Like Zelda 2, I like Zelda 2, the side-scrolling one for NES. If they worked, you know, if they changed some of the, the buttons around, you know, more than just two buttons. Using two buttons. Oh, God. Oh, I was briefly in the air. If they actually made it where you could use a button to jump and not up, and they actually had a start button for your menu, and then an attack and item button, and made it so you didn't hit the top of the screen when there's nothing there. Just little things, and, you know, up the graphics a little bit, but... And they could be fun, you know, maybe redid the voiceovers. No, you know what? The voiceovers and the animations kind of give it a charm. That'd be kind of cool if they did keep that. That'd be kind of cool. <clears throat> but if they could just revamp, revamp the, uh, the graphics a little bit so you can kind of tell where you can go and what you can do kind of thing. And then the controls as well, if they could change that around. Yeah, we got a ton of rupees when we were on the boat here, so I'm just gonna stay here and just rock it in here for a little bit. 
Call it a game, all right? You game. You, you, you game. There, I called it a game. What else do you want now? And this is the first time, this is the clearest I'm ever seeing this game, to be honest, because back when we played it originally, I had it going through my uh, original capture or older capture, and it was just capturing the uh, the regular, the regular, you know, CR, I was playing it on the CRT TV. And this is actually being captured through the HDMI converter, so this is quite clear. Smart button. You told me to call it a game, so I called it a game. What do you want me to do, Steel? I don't get it. You can go ahead and go watch a better stream. Never said my streams were good anyway, so. There we go. That's a good way of doing it. Just keep doing this. Yeah, it triggers them to come down. Nice. Oh, it didn't work. There it goes. Oh, come on, dude. Want them green rupees? No, don't jump. What am I at? 52. Well, we just got 40 in just a couple minutes. Nice. Wait, did I get the key? No, I got the key to unlock the old guy. It's not gonna be the key for this, is it? Maybe I should try that out real quick. <clears throat> is this the SNES? No, this is the Philips CDI. Were you not here earlier when I was talking about the CDI and everything? I know, you're here after we started. So this is the Philips CDI. The project that Philips wanted Nintendo to help them on. Hence why there are Mario and Zelda characters on the Philips system. Well, Philips wanted to work with Nintendo to make a CD add-on for the Super Nintendo. And Nintendo decided not to. So then Philips decided to create their own system and some people all right it's like so some people stayed with Philips to make this system and they got the rights to use Zelda characters and Mario characters in the Mario's Hotel which is a game that I would like to get someday but it is again another one of those pricey ones um, and then some people left Philips and sided with Sony because Philips was trying to get with Sony to make a CD based system which then became the PlayStation. So there you go. And uh, the CDI system, if you don't know, is one of the biggest, if not the biggest, video game consoles ever, as far as size. It is huge. So one of the reasons why I'm trying to get a, uh, <clears throat> I'm trying to get a, a setup or a, uh, shelving so I can you know have all my systems and stuff but the CDI is one of the reasons why I need it to be a certain way because it's just so honking big I can't just you know get one of those you know like cubby hole things because this won't fit into a cubby hole this is the size of two cubby holes but every time I try to find some shelving that I need it's gonna be three four hundred dollars and I don't have three or four hundred dollars to spend on just basic shelves to set up. I've already got little lights I want to set up to illuminate each of the systems, and I have all the stuff ready to go. I just don't have the shelves for it. So, anyways, so I'm just running around collecting rupees. So, it is it is a honking system. You know, like VCRs back in the back in the day, the VCRs. Um, it's the size, if not bigger than a VCR as well. Honkin? Yeah, it's a big, just honkin system. It's a hefty system. Alright, I think I'm running out of bad guys. I think they've all depleted, so let's... Leave. And then go back. What's a VCR? Oh, that didn't hit me. I killed it, and yet it still killed me. Oh, was that my last life? 
Ah, oh, poo poo platter. <clears throat> Actually, before something were to happen, let's let's go ahead and save the game. I'm gonna forget to do that. I actually like this menu music. Got a cool little thing to it. Um, let's do one more roundabout on the ship to try to get some more rupees. If I can just get by this... You know what? Let's use a... I don't want to use a bomb, but that would probably be the best way to get by this anteater gopher poop throwing thing. You know? IX? 9? What about 9? I'm talking about Stavos. I really want to... Maybe if I can glitch him off the screen, is that a thing on the CDI? I don't think so. Like the NES, you could sometimes glitch guys off the side of the screen. Or if I can drop down in time. Damn it. No, 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 oh. If I could not die and possibly keep all my hearts to the poop throwing anteater golfer, I'd be happy to get to the ship and then I can use all my lives on the ship. Stop jumping. And, and because the, the thumb pad on this goes in any direction, um, if you're not holding directly in the direction right or left you want to go like if you just inch down just a little bit you start crouching or if you just inch up just a little bit you start jumping <clears throat> i did say damn it you see you act like that's a new thing i've been saying that since i started streaming i say it from time to time Oh, I blocked it. I blocked it. No, I didn't. Oh, I landed on that. You saw that? Replay that. Johnny, roll the tape. An 8-track is something older than VCR. I, yeah, it's older than VCR. But it was still around when VCR came out, too. <clears throat> An 8-track was more audio than video. I think it actually was all just audio. Can I block it like this? Nope. Damn it all. Jump! Oh, that actually worked. I jumped off the land, back down onto the alligator. How is he hitting me? Stupid anteater. All right, you know what? Screw it. Let's just go. God. Yeah, I'm liking these green ones. That's not fair. That's not fair. How did I know that was going to hurt me? That's bogus. That's bogus for shogus. Oh, I guess if I wanted to drop down on the alligators down there, I could be ready for the, uh, the anteater poop thrower. I guess, but I'm not gonna try to do that. Let's just do this. I think I can get lucky. Let's get right on the edge of the pixel where he's throwing his poop. And then wait for the alley, alley, alligator. Yes! MLG Gaming Pro Gamer. <laughs> Hero, where are you, hero? You said you were free until the 22nd or the 21st. Well, today's the 20th, yeah. That's why we had to do your game today. Crap.
Oh, I landed on his nose. <clears throat> like I said, it's up to you guys. G shot steel Gabe. If anybody else is still sticking around. Uh, it's been almost an hour. I said I'd play for an hour. And he hasn't shown up. So I went through all of this setup for nothing. Oh, I timed that wrong. He just whispered it. Now, are you being serious? I mean, let me know if you're actually being serious. Steel. I don't need trolling right now at the moment. I don't need a troll. Well, if it's a troll right now, I'm not in the mood for trollings. Oh, I had... If it didn't turn around on me... So, no, he didn't whisper you that is what you're saying. <clears throat> I should know not to trust trust you mm -hmm. oh crap okay stop stop moving okay we're on no stop jumping you really gotta let go of that that button or the thumbstick pressing up 